guess when you think of Vancouver, you might think about the mountains and snowboarding and pouring rain. Well, how about another kind of pouring? If you've ever been to the Roxy in downtown Vancouver, you might have been served by Mark, runner-up at the International Flair Attending Competition held recently in Singapore. In second in the world in Singapore. I uh, recently represent Canada in uh, the World Flair Attending Competition. Uh, one competitor per country, and uh, I came second place. All competitors were given seven minutes to make three drinks. And uh, we were judged on the taste of the drink, so the recipe we brought to Singapore had to be good. Uh, we uh, judged on presence, sort of, you know, the personality and the attitude, sort of, kind of important for a bartender. And we were also judged on the technical flair, the difficulty of the tricks we were doing, the bottle flipping. Another of the bartenders at the Roxy nightclub, Scott Young, founded Bar Smart, the performance bartending company, back in 1994. He coaches bartenders on not just serving a drink, but serving it with flair. I took his class called Extreme Bartending, and uh, they have seminars and videos, like the one I, I bought the videos and I learned from those. And uh, the website, ExtremeBartending.com, I learned uh, you know, how to do it, and eventually I started winning some of these competitions, and he hired me as an instructor. So now I, I, I continue to uh, travel all over the world with his company and teaching people how to uh, serve drinks with style. Now we're just showing off. Okay, everyone's seen the movie Cocktail, right? You know, the one with Tom Cruise? Well, you've only been exposed to a fraction of what is possible in the field of performance or extreme bartending. The movie Cocktail had all this spilling, though, so that's something we you know, try to disassociate ourselves from the movie, but yeah, it, it was a good beginning. Scott, Mark, and the rest of the team of Bar Smart have three basic rules. Spillage of alcohol is unacceptable, you don't have to slow down and make a drink with style, and never practice at work. For Inside Entertainment in Vancouver, I'm Guy Gagné.